human mind. 600 miles of synaptic fiber, five and a half ounces of cranial fluid, 1,500 grams of complex neural matter, a three-pound pile of dreams. But I'll tell you what it really is. It is the ultimate battlefield and the ultimate weapon. The wars of this modern age, the psychic age, are all fought somewhere between these damp, curvaceous undulations. From this day forward, you are all psychic soldiers, paranormal paratroopers, mental marines who are about to ship out on the adventure of their lives. This is our beachhead, and this is your landing craft. You shall engage the enemy in his own mentality. You shall chase his dreams. You shall fight his demons. You shall live his nightmares. And those of you who fight well, you will find yourselves on the path to becoming international secret agents. In other words, psychonauts. The rest of you will die. Oh, Maury. Children, you are not going to die. Well, if you're not a psychonaut, then you might as well be dead. They told me this was a summer camp. Ah, <laughs> oh, Dogen. Don't worry about old Coach Oleander. I've been coming here for years, and trust me, nothing ever happens. Yeah, Dogen, Lily's right. You don't got nothing to worry about. Except for that giant monster in the lake I was telling you about. Bobby Zilch, I told you to stop scaring people with that ridiculous old legend. I don't want the kids to be afraid to go out at night and walk alone on the perfectly safe paths of Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp. And we don't want to scare our special guests, Superstar Psychonauts Sasha Nine and Mia Vodello. Whoa. Light monster! Formation. It's resisting. Quick, bring it over here. What is it? It's just a little boy. What's your name, darling? I'll find out. Kid, get in! Ugh. My name starts with a D. Is Rasputin. But everybody calls me Raz. Please don't kill us, Lake Monster! Compelling. Armored like a tank! Sorry I'm late. I don't want to disrupt your briefing, Agent Oleander. Agents 9, Vodello, please, continue. Where do you think you're going? You've broken into a highly classified remote government training facility. I know. Isn't it great? Listen, why don't I just sit over here quietly with my fellow psychedets? Hey, how's it going? I like your hat. We need to have this young man taken from here immediately. I'll call his parents. What? But don't you train psychonauts here? Yes, darling, but... To soar across the astral plane. To wage psychic warfare against the enemies of free thought. That is what I wrote on the front of the pamphlet. Those words are why I'm here, Coach Oleander. Do you remember what you wrote on the inside of that pamphlet? You were born with a special gift. But the people around you treat it like a curse. Your mother is afraid of you. And your father looks at you with shame in his eyes. Come to Whispering Rock Psychic Summer Camp, and you can show them all. Back home, your powers make you a loner, an outcast, a circus freak. But in this dojo, 
in this psychic dojo, they make you a hero. Get that soldier a bunk. Now, darling, you can stay here for a few days until your parents come for you, but we can't let you participate in any paranormal training without your parents' consent. I'm sorry. Wowie, you're so lucky. You get to go home soon. Home? Back there, I was just like you were, Dogen. Punished by my own family for having powers I never asked for. But here, I have a chance to be something, to make a difference. They may come for me, Dogen, but they'll be looking for Raz, the boy. What they're going to find, what they don't expect, is Raz, the Psychonaut. And, and, and then you'll make their heads explode? No. Do you do that? No. Well, once, kind of. But... Now I wear this special hat. Want to try it on? No, no, no. But he has mental defenses like I've never seen in someone so young. If I could just get him in my lab for some experiments, I'm sure he could withstand more than the others. That kid's one in a million, Nine. But I'm not gonna let you turn him into one of your guinea pigs. I've got big plans for that mind. All right, so finally starting. Um, so here we've got Raz. He is our protagonist, and all right, settle down in here. Big day tomorrow! I want to see each and every one of you runs in my classroom at 0600 hours on the dot! I'm the early bird, and you're the worms. Got it? Now, lights out! So, with Raz, he has this huge sort of backstory behind him about why he wants to be a psychonaut so bad. But we're not going to find that out for a while, I don't think. Oh, okay, hello. quick eye exam before we start. Huh? Look over that way if you will. Wow, what's that? Oh, that's a side challenge marker. The staff scatters these all over the camp to test the students. Every one of these you find advances you a whole rank. Uh huh. Now look up for me if you will. Hmm. Some of the old markers have fallen apart. You'll find bits of them flapping around loose. If you find enough of these side cards, you can put them together to make a brand new challenge marker. But you have to buy a side core at the camp store to hold them together. Keep ranking up, and before you know it, you'll be able to use brand new psychic powers. Stuff you didn't even know you could do. And then when do I become a psychonaut? Because I have to do that before my dad shows up to take me home. Hey, where'd he go? Well, that guy looks so familiar. So, welcome to the world of Psychonauts. Um... Hey, Raz! Hurry up! You don't want to be late for basic braining! Woohoo! Basic braining is the best class ever! Woohoo! So, let me just try to get a handle for the controls here. So nice! And he knows everything! Alright, here we go. I'm telling you for the last time, no! I would never do that. I could never kill everyone. Oh, hi, Raz. Squirrel trouble? They're liars is all. Whatever they tell you, it's a lie. I'll take your word for it. You going to class? Yeah. I'll meet you up there. As soon as I get these guys to shut up. <laughs> yeah, okay. Dogen. 
<laughs> Alright, there's my first Psy card. So, this is a bit of a funny situation for me. I have not personally played this game myself. I have seen a walkthrough of it because my friend uh, Ness asked me, excuse me, to um, check it out. You, new boy, seen bear lurking in woods? Nope. Was it you? Giant, hairless bear? Nope. In Russia, bears much smaller, also more hair, less lurking, always eager to wrestle. This one, hide and run. I'll let you know if I see anything. Cannot let forever, bear. Uh, my friend Ness told me about the game and said I would probably like it, so I gave it a shot, as you can see. And then, well, I watched the walkthrough, and I really, 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 really enjoyed the walkthrough. So, um, I was saying, oh, I really want this game, and he offered to buy it for me, and he did, and... Oh, I can't see anything! I've only just started, and already I can, I can just, I just love it. You know that cabin is empty, right? Duh! I'm practicing for tonight, when it's gonna be full of ladies. That kind of thing takes practice? Um, excuse me, but my parents let me watch R-rated movies, so I think I know a little bit more about this than you do, okay? <laughs> and by worst, did you possibly mean the best? Because that's what I was thinking. No, I meant worst, I as in I can't even believe we're friends and so bad. Audio. So I'm just gonna look around a bit and pick up everything I can before I get, like, actually into the gameplay. Because from what I've heard, this beginning part, the basic braining, is really, really hard. <laughs> so, you're dating Elka now. Does that mean we won't hang out as much? Shoot, I reckon things ain't gonna change one bit. Doggone it, partner. No woman's never gonna... Hey, you're gonna make my boyfriend late for class. Come on, James. <sighs> Come. On. They're like ten. Don't think I can go up that way, so I'm not gonna really try. <laughs> So, um, this is partially blind, as I said. Um, I only finished watching the walkthrough last night, and I don't have the greatest of memory. Also, I think this is a game that might be a little bit difficult to pr uh, prepare for. Though, definitely, 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 definitely gonna be so much fun. So this is probably going to be the first Let's Play on our channel, since the boys have gone... Hey, where are you going, Maloof? Oh, they've gone on vacation? Shh, I snuck out! That class is a death trap for crazy people! Listen, the coach is strong. At the start of class, he pulls you into his mind, and then there's nothing you can do about it. But once you're in, you can use these smelling salts to sneak out. Take mine. I don't need them anymore. I'm calling my parents to come get me before I get hurt. Too late! Bobby! Ah! Hey, kid! You owe me five arrowheads for this week's protection service. Cough it up, my loser. Or you'll be coughing a bloody tear. Hey, leave him alone. I heard a rumor that you were raised in the circus. Well, let me put this in terms you'll understand. I'm the strong man around here. Really? Because you look more like the cotton candy. <laughs> <laughs> Benny, put this kid 